have arsenic in the crude oil, and the heavier the crude, the more arsenic content. Plus, we have the spraying going on where the EPA says that at least for one formula of Corexit, if they're even using that formula, but, it, you know, here's on record anyway, that's got 0.16 parts per million arsenic in it. Now, remember, 0.10 parts uh, per billion, not million, but parts per billion is considered uh, um, uh, the threshold of being safe. Anything over uh, 0.010 parts per billion. Now, we're talking about 0.16 parts per million. In other words, the concentration is really, really high. That's what's incorrect at EC 9500A, according to the EPA. Now, here's from an interview with a BP cleanup worker, and this was on GRC Radio in South Carolina on September 30th, 2010. Aircraft spraying with no lights at night. The people on board thought the boat was on fire. We kept smelling burnt wire. We didn't realize it was the smell of arsenic. It's the chemicals that were being sprayed that left that smell. Our lungs filled up with fluid. Can't breathe. Terrible, terrible headaches, skin lesions. I want to live to see my granddaughter. People, we really need help. Now, that's on YouTube. It's also on our site on World Vision Portal, and it's uh, linked right there in this article. Go ahead and listen to this caller and hear it for yourself. Now, remember what she said. We kept smelling burnt wire and didn't realize it was the smell of arsenic. And then she gave the, the typical, uh, which we'll find out, um, symptoms of arsenic poisoning. Our lungs fill up with fluid, can't breathe, terrible, terrible headaches, skin lesions. All right now, this falls along with what we've called the, the uh, Gulf Blue Flu all along. But these are specific things that happen with arsenic. And that has been uh, the initial onset of exposure to Gulf Blue Flu, of which now really is Gulf Blue Plague. Arsenic trioxide is 500 times more toxic than pure arsenic, and its fumes have an odor somewhat resembling garlic. This and other similar arsenic compounds have also been reported to smell like shorted electrical wires or burnt wiring. Now, remember what that lady said on the broadcast I just quoted? We kept smelling burnt wire. We didn't realize. It was the smell of arsenic. Now, actually, arsenic of and by itself, pure arsenic, doesn't have a smell. But these arsenic compounds, when chemicals are added to arsenic, arsenic is an element that's found in the earth. Okay, It's not something that's made in a lab. It's an element in the earth. And its abbreviation on the elemental table is a small s. So arsenic of and by itself, okay, it doesn't smell something like garlic or burnt wiring. However, let me read back again. Arsenic trioxide. Now, this is a triple oxygen ars arsenic chemical creation. is 500 times more toxic than pure arsenic, and its fumes have an odor somewhat resembling garlic. This and other similar arsenic compounds have also been reported to smell like shorted electrical wires or burnt wiring. Arsenic, as well as most arsenic compounds, rises in heat at atmospheric pressure, converting directly to a gaseous form. If there is an arsenic compound being sprayed, you'd be able to smell it immediately on contact. If there were arsenic compounds in the Gulf of Mexico at any depth, when they come to the surface and become a gas, you would smell it. Those along the Gulf of Mexico and those who've been working from their boats have smelled it repeatedly. That's all the evidence we need. Just remember, arsenic as well as arsenic compounds 
rise in heat. Now, the Gulf of Mexico is uh, one of the warmest bodies of ocean there is. So arsenic and arsenic compounds rise in heat at atmospheric pressure, converting directly to a gaseous form. It's in the air, people. It's in the water, it's in the air. If it's in the water, it's in the air. And who needs more evidence than that? People smell it. If you live here, if you live here along the coast, or even within 20 miles inland, or actually I've had a report already of on the east coast of Florida that somebody that says they smelled something that was like burnt wire in their garlic. 